Previously on Heads of Space, we learned a comet or whatever was headed for Earth. So the Kenyan President of the United States sent all the presidential candidates to Mars so we could rebuild the human race. But things didn't go as the establishment planned. Low energy Jeb, out in nothingness. Little Marco, broke. Lion rat fucker Ted killed himself, and crazy commie Bernie, also dead. Then we had a terrible crash landing, and here we are. I hope you're not all idiots, so I don't have to explain it again. Oh, dang it. What a disaster. They're all dead. My motherboard was right. I'm hardwired for failure. <laughs> Tears are for losers, metal dick. Well, he probably took a minute to, you know, look in the mirror and reflect for a moment. That always makes me cry. <laughs> Sadness. You two, alive? Of course I'm alive. Only losers die. God Almighty tried to take me, but I said, uh-uh, bub. Not before I set foot in the White House again. <laughs> well, we did it. You're the first humans to set foot on Mars. This is our new home. This place? It's a dump. Not nearly as nice as my mars -a -Lago Resort, mars -a -Lago, the most luxurious, amazing hotel in Mars, with garden view rooms and private villas exclusive for members of our upscale Platinum VIP Club Diamond Plus. We don't have time for plugs. We have to get to safety soon or we'll die out here. Well, you'll die. I won't, but I've been programmed to get sad if I'm alone. I love being alive. I'm literally the greatest person at being alive in the history of it ever. That I can tell you. Sure, honey. Hey, what's Hillary doing? I claim this planet in the name of the United States of America, which I love more than Super Pac. Oh, too late. I claim dibs. Mars is mine. I'm renaming it Mars -a Lago. It's gonna be fandabulous. No way, Donald. My data team indicates that the preferred view among undecided voters is that Mars should be for everyone. And it is. As long as they pay a $100,000 membership fee plus $13,000 per year and also- Stop it. Stop it. This is a serious situation. Our supplies were destroyed in the crash, so if we don't get to the intended landing spot soon, we're dead. We don't have much time. Our only hope is to use this ship as a rover and travel all the way across Mars as fast as possible. Do you get what I'm saying? I think I do. Hillary? Yep. Road trip! Yes! Oh, this will be great! No, it's not a road trip. It's a rescue mission. On the road with us all driving together. Sounds like a road trip. Can we listen to UB40? They're a little edgy, but I like them. Okay, fine. Call it what you like. Ooh, shotgun. shotgun. Look, I get shotgun, or this is rigged. Oh, not comfortable with a woman riding shotgun? Well, that's a pretty sexist attitude, Donnie. No way. Females love me. They love me. Even the really, really ugly ones. Oh, that's exactly the type of misogynist thinking that Come on! Stop arguing! There are two shotgun seats, you imbeciles. <laughs> now get in the rover. Let's go! I spy with my little eye something, uh, red. Is it, uh, Mars Rock? Yes! You go. I spy with my little eye something red. Oh, is it a Mars Rock? Yes! Okay, I spy with my little eye something, uh, Truck? Yes! Stop! Stop this game! You've been playing it for hours! I can't take it anymore! I'll stop if she stops! I'll stop if he stops! Stop! stop. Jinx! jinx. One, one, two, three, four, four five, six, six, seven, eight, nine! Personal jinx. jinx! I'm not gonna be the first one to stop! I spy with my little eye! All you ever see is red Mars rock! That's all there is! Something black! Is it that big black wall? What? And it's beautiful on the other side, but it's impossible to cross this wall. Believe me, I know walls. You sure, Donald? Is it just me, or you guys feel like raping something? Hey, not so fast. You're not allowed to pass. I feel like I should be getting some irony from this situation, but I'm too stupid. It's so red. At least that's how my eyes perceive it. I don't want to exclude our colorblind friends. It's round? I thought it would be flat, like Earth. 